What up, this is Tyler Flanagan. I'm 17 years old and I'm from Mammoth Lakes, California. Yeah, so I was just cruising with Mark and uh, he asked me if I wanted to come out and do the Transworld Park sessions with him and his brother and Yerman. I'd never turn this down. My name's Craig McMorris. I'm 19 years old and I hail from Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. Mark called me, he's like, you're invited to do this uh, photo shoot with Transworld and, I, and Mark's not very good at explaining things so I had no idea what I was getting myself into. My name is Jarman Broughton, I'm from Norway and I'm 20 years old. I was in Norway for the Arctic Challenge and then I met Mark and he asked me if I wanted to come to Aspen to ride and to do a little shoot with Transworld and then I was like, yeah, totally. I'm Mark McMorris, I'm 17 years old and I'm from Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. I've had a pretty long contest season and this is pretty much my favorite part of snowboarding, just progressing and to have really good setups, no time worries, everybody's laid back and to be riding with like three of my favorite riders, it just made it like the ultimate session for me and I would take this over any contest any day. Everything in the park is pretty sick, like down at the bottom you can go through the half pipes and then you know cut off to the side and like hit a rail and then on the side of the jump there's just a quarter pipe built. So it's like it's like skateboarding through the park, it's sick. It's a lot of fun for one right? Last night we kind of got a cool sunset shoot. We were just uh, sessioning just the top of the public park. Like anybody could hit that any day. It's really fun to hit some small rails. We got to try some new tricks. Yeah, this morning was the best session ever. Me and Mark had so much fun and it's great to ride with a guy that pushes me that much and it's just tearing it down. There was definitely something special. I felt really good when I woke up. The sun came out exactly when we got to the top of the jump in the cat. The sled was running. Filmers were in their place and then Yerman just started doing some crazy tricks right off the bat and I was like, okay, I gotta match this guy. Crazy biking.
has like two back tens and I look at him weird. I'm like, you always do back tens. Why did you be doing back tens? He's like, think I got it? I didn't feel pressure, but I just asked Craig like, do you think I had the air to try it? And then he's like, yeah, you just need to go a little deep in the landing and then, I don't know, I just tried it. I don't know why, I just felt it. And... Last, probably the funnest couple days I've had all year, just cruising with the friends. It's been awesome. This uh, this park that, that these guys shot in is our normal offering for our guests every day, and uh, it, this is the really exciting part of this shoot. So hope to see a lot of people to come in and ride with us. Well, uh, Snow Mass is like probably one of the best parks I've ever ridden in my life. Uh, being from Regina, I never get to really like ride a park, like a really good, just built features all the time. So when uh, we were at the top of the lift and saw like what we were about to do, I just got so excited and like realized like this is what people get to hit every single day, like absolute perfection every day. Can't really ask for more out of a place. Yeah, I can expose a secret about Mark. Um, three years ago, we're riding this resort. Knuckles a jump, right? And you know what happens sometimes when you knuckle a jump? Just, just like poos his pants, like awful, just disgusting. Rides down to the bottom, and and he stands there, and we can all just tell like something's wrong. Like he's just standing there, really quiet, like kind of fishing around. And then all of a sudden, then all of a sudden, he just goes like, he's like, you guys want to do another lap? Like, there's literally poo in your pants and you want to do another lap. That's disgusting as it is, but it shows his drive and, and determination. Because even when there's poo in his pants, Mark will still send it. He doesn't care. 